of honour were their majesties the King and Queen, who visited the aerodrome at Bircham Newton, Norfolk. This was their first visit to a service aerodrome since the armistice. Some idea of the intense interest taken in the air service will be appreciated when we realise that on the first Empire Air Day, nearly 100,000 people took the opportunity of seeing the Royal Air Force at home. At the different RAF stations, visitors saw the training of pilots, signalers, and all the other specialists engaged in this highly skilled craft of air defence and warfare. Their Majesties made a tour of inspection and showed enthusiastic interest in every detail of the various types of machines and other equipment. After seeing the day and night bombing planes, Their Majesties inspected the fighters and other aircraft. In one of the hangars, the Queen saw the latest types of parachute gear, cameras, bombs, etc., whilst His Majesty was shown torpedoes, carriers and firing gear. They then saw a wonderful display of aerobatics, formation flying and stunting from the view room of 207 Squadron. At the other stations there were mimic air fights and other demonstrations. Their Majesties were obviously deeply impressed with the efficiency of this arm of the service. <laughs>